I was doing my usual research on poultry farming and I found a very very interesting article on researchers feeding chickens with cannabis instead of antibiotics and we know that antibiotics usually causes antibiotic resistance in chicken and that when consumers consume that, that meat may also be affected by antibiotic resistance. So there's a farm in Thailand, Northern Thailand, which is feeding cannabis to their chicken and they have been doing this for over, uh, over, for over a year now. So this is what they have, you know, this, this is the result according to this article, is that the cannabis they are using, they, they collected the cannabis, then, then they dried and then crushed. Now they are using the cannabis in water and in feeds. And then they are withdrawing now the antibiotics. So, what is the result? The result is that the amount of death that was there is exactly the same that is now when now they are using antibiotic, uh, when now they are replacing the antibiotics with the cannabis. So, it seems that the antibiotics are almost the same with the cannabis. And also, you should note that cannabis is a natural product, so there is no risk of antibiotic resistant. So far, we have seen that cannabis is much better compared now to the compared to the antibiotics. And a professor, assistant professor in that in that university, you know, says that why you know why the why the cannabis is much more better or is performing as a you know, as performing this way is that the cannabis contains bioactive compounds which usually promote better metabolic activity in birds and boost the immunity of the usually boost the immunity of the chicken. And we and we have been seeing this case again and again that herbs are you know are enhancing the immunity of our chickens also are promoting the growth. But however the researchers the researchers have not tested whether the bird will survive against diseases such as bird flu and other chicken diseases. But I think I'll, I'll get into more depth into this video about using antibiotics, uh, of, uh, about using the cannabis now in chicken. And I'll post that video on my course. You can see today I posted a video on organic chicken farming. The course that I've been telling you guys, we launched on on today and my viewers those who have subscribed to the course they they are going to access that course through as you have communicated through the emails so the question is what if a consumer now consume this meat that that has been fed with cannabis will them will they get high no they will not get high because the cannabis contains something called the THC that is the tetrahydrocannabinol and this active ingredient now, the, now is the one which is beneficial now to chicken and, and it does not cause highness or being high but the researchers did not rule out the case that it can cause highness in chicken so more research need to be done on this one and I'll, and I'll dive into that video and then I'll post it to my you know to my subscribers who have joined the organic farming course so you should join the link below and yeah so you should know that also this this organic chicken chicken meat on, on any product from organic chickens usually fetches dub, almost double the amount and consumers usually are willing to pay double the amount because that meat is is pure and and it has not been fed with antibiotics which usually consumers are afraid of so you should just try try farming your chickens with these herbs and you're going to possibly increase your profits